songs and felicitations. Okay, the first round. Boom. <laughs> and oh, geez, that was boom. just unnecessary. You kidding me? You can't be out of range. Greetings and felicitations, YouTube. You're all with the Appian Way here, and it wouldn't be a recording on my channel if I didn't have some kind of technical difficulties. I was about 30 minutes into a video, and then the power died in my house. Boom, gone, recording corrupted, boom, all of it, done, zip, not a silge. So, what happened in, in the meantime? Well, in the meantime, um, everybody, and I do mean everybody, is at war with the Holy Roman Empire now. Um, England, France, Sicily, and Hungary have joined the Crusade. This caused Sicily to lose its alliances with both Venice and Hungary, I think. And then Hungary went and joined the Crusade anyway. Um, I fought a very significant battle right here. Schweizerpelk fought on this bridge to hold off a force from Frankfurt. Uh, and a force on the other side of the bridge. So I actually had to do a bridge defense on two sides. It was really cool. You don't get any evidence that it happened. So uh, what's the next step for me? The next step for me is I am going to redistribute this army a little bit and then take advantage of the crusade by buying crusader knights and pilgrims to fill in the rest of this 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 army roster. And then that is going to arm me and gird me enough to be able to march down here, take on the forces gathered at Nuremberg, and then, uh, <coughs> thus falls the Holy Roman Empire. Because everybody's going for Bologna right now. And I am so thrilled about that. I'm just going in trying to kill off all of the Holy Roman Empire's armies so that everybody else can just pick them apart. Because I don't even need their territory. This is all about just ending the threat of the Holy Roman Empire once and for all for me. And also, finally, I'm proud proud to announce that Prince Perrin, faction heir of Marseille, Prince Perrin de Marseille, has arrived at Stetton. <laughs> He's my new faction heir. Let's merge the fleets. And get them to start chasing after the Holy Roman Empire boats. Actually, if I position this fleet right here, I think I can close off all threats coming into the uh, Baltic. Oh, I also managed to get a peace treaty with Denmark, so I'm no longer at war with them. Alright, my plan right now, I'm going to go ahead and lay siege to Nuremberg. I'm going to force Captain Earhart to decide to attack me. Now, when I was doing this just now, I had already started engaging these armies by going after Captain Siegfried first. The garrison at Nuremberg is actually a lot bigger than that flag led me on to believe. So I kind of got lucky that that battle got 86th by the power outage. Um, but I was doing fairly well. It already eliminated this dinky little Siegfried force, and I was facing down um, Jens von Austria's army very efficiently before Captain Erhard's army even caught up onto the battlefield. It was, uh, it was going fairly well, or actually it was the other way around. I was I was facing this army that had, been, had, the, had the peasants, and then the other side of the battlefield was this force by Jens von Austria. But I think I'm just going to go ahead and siege Nuremberg force them to decide how they want to engage my superior crusading army. Wahahaha. In the meantime, I think I'm done with this turn. I'm just gonna go see if there's anything to build. Oh, I do have some new generals. So I can start spreading that love. Oh no, my mission to assassinate Dieter failed. Whatever. Don't care. So sad. I think... My next goal here. Ooh, 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 Schweizpelk of Polak. He's in Vienna. Excellent. Okay, so that's yet another character I can send somewhere. Milan and Sicily are now at war. England got a very quick truce with the Holy Roman Empire. And Portugal and England have a truce now as well. So England's got a lot less to worry about. Um, I can't wait to find the French and Hungarian crusading armies. And the Sicilian Crusading Army, too, is going to be neat. I'm going to start sending What's Annie Herman to go over to talk to the Sicilians, yes. if there are any available. I'm sure you will, too, Annie. And the Germans scattered. They don't really want to have anything to do with my invading force at Nuremberg, so let's just go ahead and knock it over. All to resolve that. 
Only 55 casualties, thank you very much. And... Ooh, that's a lot of Florence. We'll sack that. And I'm gonna go ahead and use the army to just eliminate what's left. And... Ooh. Ah, this is interesting. Do we just push and go after... Earhart's army now? I probably should. I left Nuremberg undefended. He could reach it. Yeah, let's, let's push this. So Thorsten's army I gotta quickly eliminate, and then I've gotta deal with a bunch of peasants and knights. Not a big deal. We could fight this one. Alright. The race is on. Well, of course he's on top of the hill. And of course he's abandoning this tiny little village. <laughs> He was thinking about holding here, but maybe he's not so confident of that anymore. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and just blitz the cavalry on in here. It is a bunch of spearmen, but they are very, very outnumbered. The battle is very much in our favor. If you think? We true and steadfast, victory will be ours. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half the enemy gen Look how our cowardly foe Ooh. Run. It's time to Oh my back. goodness! I got onto the battlefield before the reinforcements did. <gasps> oh my gosh. The reinforcements hadn't even made it onto the, the battlefield. I just straight up won. <laughs> I accept. It I didn't even know that was possible! Or was it that the reinforcements couldn't arrive? Sometimes that happened. I didn't know that happened in Medieval 2, though. I think... I, I don't even know. I'm actually kind of on the fence about if that's a thing that still happens by the time of this game, but older Total War titles, some of them had it so that your reinforcements just wouldn't show up. Like, there was communication error. Our, our, our reinforcements haven't arrived. I, oh, I'm gonna have to go back and see if that's what happened. The enemy are bringing in reinforcements. Because I just straight up ran those four out off the battlefield into routing, and then because all their units are routing, the battle was over. I'm shocked. Okay, well they are gone. <laughs> that's all you want? Apparently they're bankrupt. Okay, yeah, sure. I'm, I'm cool with that. Uh, happy trading. <laughs> that was painfully easy. I've found a way to blockade out the uh, the German fleet. From from just north of Copenhagen. New mission, blockade port. But I just started doing other stuff. Fine, let's go blockade this. Desertion in the Crusading Army, because they're not making fast enough progress, I suppose. That's okay, though. I'm not actually trying to take Bologna. I am just trying to cause as much devastation to... Oh my god, Hungary has arrived. <laughs> Hungary's gonna get it. Oh, they've, they've set up a full garrison, though. Yikes! Oh, this is gonna be fun. I wish I could watch that battle. The two the two armies that I most need out of my way right now. <laughs> Hungary and Germany. Oh, they just had to put... <sighs> like, I was just about to get this guy up here to Thorn, and then they just had to put some rebels in my way. Here we go. Just get rid of that, please. Thank you. Thank you. Everybody get some experience. Yep, yep. Oh, uh, oh yeah. Yeah, aren't you proud? Everybody, go, go do your jobs. Alright, so I lost some units here. That's fine. We can just replace it with more pilgrims. I legit have nobody in Nuremberg right now. It's kind of funny. Hello, Fortress at Innsbruck. Now, that is a position I wouldn't mind keeping. That would also completely cut off Holy Roman Empire from Bologna if I were to take Innsbruck. They, they wouldn't have any way of reinforcing it from the Alps. 
tactically sound, but I don't even know that the uh, the AI is smart enough to do that. Um, I think it's about time I start working on a uh, on, on invading on Bulgar. They've got this prince Bulgar just out here. Deal with you. Easier, yes? Oh, I'll deal with you. Who is not coming along? Let's see here. I'll, I'll leave behind these tiny units. Oh, it's a castle. That's why I can't do the taxes. Of course, I knew that. Duh. Who peed in the snow right here? Oh, look. Rebels outside of Kiev. Die, rebel scum. Die, rebel scum. Okay, everybody, back to Kiev. Get just the Polish nobles back to Kiev. Prevent a rebellion, please. Okay. Next turn, please. Raise taxes on Kiev. Thank you very much. Desertion in the army again. But I'm heading. I'm. I'm like right next door. I'm already at the Alps. I'm losing all of these pilgrims, militia, dismounted Polish nobles. I lost Polish retainers. I lost. Dang it. Uh, oh my gosh! And the French army has arrived. <laughs> Well, we're going to go ahead and attack Innsbruck anyway. Forget the rest of you. Oh my god, it's like an army of nothing but pilgrims at this point. <laughs> and there's a German force right next door to Nuremberg going, Hey, wait a minute, is there nobody defending it? Well, there will be now. Pirates. Great. And more rebels. Got rebels just popping up everywhere. Just dealing with as many rebel nuisances as possible right now. Cleaning them out. Moving on to the next big thing. This crusade has been entertaining, but it is time to actually make progress on this war. On this total war. And I'll eliminate Russia by taking care of Bulgar, but they're, they look like they're getting ready to defend it. Now then, somewhere on this road was. Of course, my lord. Well, I thought there was a prince. As you wish. On my Let's see if he did something clever to try and like go around me. I've got like my scout priests out here. <laughs> what's the what's the what's the situation with the college cardinals? <laughs> I've got five right now in the college of cardinals, but. There's so many ahead of me for Preferiti. <laughs> wow, this Most Holy is not too pleased with me right now. That's that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Sicilian. Oh my god, another... I've got to get myself to, to a uh, Earl Stable so I can start making Hussars. Okay, so... That means right here. Boom. Baron Stables. Gotta start working on it at Thorn. More rebels. Some replacement Polish retainers, please. And the Sicilian army has arrived at Bologna as well. <laughs> Hungary wants to talk to me. Okay, let's hear what you have to say. Not a thing. All right then. Never mind. Somebody else wants to marry Annie. Uh, 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 uh no. How many troops I lose this time? Five, six, seven, eight units. Oh my goodness. No, I've lost one of my most valuable resources. I've lost one of my merchants in the silk trade. I thought England wasn't even at war with the Holy Roman Empire anymore. There's now four crusading armies at Bologna. Is anybody going to lay siege to it? Guys. Oh no. My army is getting really small now. Let's go ahead and do this assault to Innsbruck with my rapidly depl uh, deplenishing army. Good ward. I have three dismounted feudal knights, and I've got mostly just pilgrims. <laughs> this is not going to work. This is not going to work. I am not doing that. I'm just going to lose more and more troops. I can't believe I'm paying for all these troops. Uh, I need to assault. I need to assault now. Honor and courage, soldier. Oh my gosh. Let's just do it. Let's get it over with. I paid for those troops. I don't want to, like, risk losing them again. 
I'm so mad at the other crusading armies. Nobody's being brave enough to actually lay siege to it. And there's four crusading armies on top of Bologna. I've never seen anything so absurd. Okay. Let's just get this over with. I'll be very impressed if my forces can manage to uh, take these walls from three dismounted um, feudal knights. I've got my crossbowmen now up here in position where they can just start opening fire at will. There go the crossbow bolts. Huh. Ah, I see. They got another line moving. That's what it is. Okay. I was very confused by their formation. They can drop that battering ram and just get up here. I'm actually going to break the gates. Okay, time to just put everybody through the... Right through in here, yeah. I don't really know how I'm going to deal with all of these units. I'm going to keep trying, though. Alright, General. Pull through, pull through, pull through. Oof, more feudal knights coming out to face me. I just want to slow down the infantry enough to get my... Oh, hey, look at that. Where's our general? He's falling back. I'm trying to get into positions where I can... Where I can surround feudal knights. Yeah. They have a secondary wall. Shoot. That's a problem. Don't think I'm going to be able to crack the second wall. I could theoretically bring the other battering ram in. Let's just see who I can kill. Uh, I need to do some rear charges on, on these uh, knights and peasants. Get a rear charge on this. Come on, General's bodyguard. Carve him up. Look at this the one dude up here. They have lost half their men. Our this men has been gnarly. If we continue like this. I think I can win this uh, up here. I'm just going to go ahead and focus fire on some peasant crossbowmen now. I've pretty much taken the walls. I'm just trying to convince some of their knights to run away, which is easier said than done. Hey, we got somebody to run. This my pilgrims are working overtime right now. We <laughs> have two in here, one in that unit. Oh my god! I'm gonna get my general out of this. It's a bunch of spearmen having a great time in the middle of this. Let's change targets now to the uh, dismounted feudal knights that are up here. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Okay, good. What do I have to do to remain true and steadfast? I'd very appreciate it if somebody else can end this crusade before I have to march all the way to Bologna with this battered army. Good lord. But getting getting Innsbruck is a big deal. Let's rear charge its armored sergeants again. Got him. My crossbowmen are still trying to shoot all this up. Uh oh. I think they decided they don't need to stay on the walls anymore. Actually have a regrouped knight, uh, sorry, regrouped pilgrim out here. Charge the enemy? How about charge the enemy? They're not doing anything. Oh, I need to move them. Uh-uh, no. They're having trouble with the, uh, the pathing right now. Don't like that. Lost the Crusader Sergeant. Oh, boy. Oh, 
got to try and keep some of my uh, some of my guys alive to man this battering ram. Just gonna lead these guys on merry chase, I think. A lot of feudal knights to still deal with. Or are they not chasing me? I think they're falling back. Ooh. Let's see if we can't pick some of them off as they route. They're not exactly routing, but they are falling back to the protection of the, of the next keep layer. So I'm going to use my cavalry to charge them as they're regrouping. Okay, that one's pretty much smashed. Now i got to try and hit this other one before they get to uh, regroup. Because I do not want to deal with too many dismounted field knights. Look at this. My Polish nobles and my, my general's bodyguard really battered, but I'm going to give them a quick hit and run. Alright, we got our hit, and now we're running. So we're also getting shot now. Let's see what they do. Hopefully they'll chase. Okay, they're gonna route again. I'm gonna hit and run again. Try and slow them down, get my crossbows up here into range. General out here, leading the charge. Okay, I'm gonna disengage now, go back, run over these guys before they can do too much. Trying to get my crossbows in range to do something about this. I think they're just out of range, though. Yeah, they're gonna get inside with 22 of those guys, and that is not what I want. Yeah, they're in. Alright, fall back. Fall back! Oh, did I just pull them out? That'd be great if I did! battering ram up here. I think I did. <gasps> Let's get some crossbow rounds, please. Pretty please. Uh, camera. Camera, no. Ah. Okay. I'm gonna line up the crossbows here. And then I'm gonna have them start shooting over the walls to get the general's bodyguard. Because that 23... 23 cavalry is not something I can face right now. Never mind 22 dismounted feudal knights, but hey, we'll see what we can do. Bad news. That tower has got flaming shot. I've just got to get lucky here. Meanwhile, my crossbowmen are trying to shoot the general's bodyguard. They've not killed anyone yet. Gosh. Please don't set it on fire. I have another battering ram. I just. I shudder to think what my troops' morale is gonna do if they have to go all the way back to grab the other battering ram. Oh, I think I got deflated. Ha ha ha! Okay. On to the next chance, and then the next one, and then the next one. Still nobody dead in the general's bodyguard. Come on, if, this, if these were crossbowmen in, in Total War, um, Warhammer, I'd be getting some horrific casualties on that General's Bodyguard. I think it's because of the, the poor angle, because they have to lob their, their shots, they're just... They're just not getting any accuracy. I'm gonna have to freaking use my crossbowmen in melee against General's Bodyguard. It's just not happening! Oh man, now I'm thinking I might need to just stop shooting and save their ammo so they can be more accurate. But the second I try and move them through that gate, they're gonna charge. Ugh. Then halt this turn of events. Shush you. <laughs> That's okay, I don't mind losing this entire army because, like I said, I don't want to actually be in, in on this crusade. I just want to hurt the Holy Road Empire a lot. Okay. Here's the plan. These three units... Oh, wait a minute. Shoot through the gate at the General's Bodyguard. They may need to move up a bit. Guys, 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 just line up and shoot through the gap. Right. 
let's stop their charge real quick. Oh, shush you. Come on, crossbows. Here comes the feudal knights. Get out of there, nobles. Get out of there. Polish nobles. Come on, Polish nobles. Ah, can't see. Rear charge dismounted feudal knights. Oh my gosh, I got the routing. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay, okay. How many are left? Three left. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, good lord, they're going after my... Hold your ground, men! Hold your ground! Okay, now I get these guys to rear charge it. Mob the general's bodyguard. Go, crossbowmen, go! I'm doing just fine! Look, the balance of power is now in my favor. Defeat seems certain. Victory is the possibility. It's going back and forth, back and forth. I lost my last Polish noble. I'm gonna use my general's bodyguard to go after the peasant crossbowmen here. So I realize I'm getting sh rear attacked. Oh no, General! General! No! Our general lies slain upon the battlefield. All that's left are the the peasant crossbowmen. I think, I think that's it. No kidding. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> Got his general spider guard down to eight. Ah, oh. what a shame. What a shame. Oh, they're offering me my my units back as ransom. Um, it's just it's just mercenaries. The whole thing, like one unit of town militia. I'm gonna decline. Don't even want the army back. <laughs> and my forces melt away. My participation in the crusade is over. Dear France, England, Hungary, Sicily, do something. <laughs> anyway, on that note, that's my end screen. Ta-ta. I love you all. I'll see you guys in the next video.